Your tickets remain valid. You must merely wait patiently for the exhibition to reopen. Please disperse. The exhibition is closed. What's this about? Oh, Lapiota, give me strength. I can't bear this, please! I believe I've been clear. No presentation today. Oh, wait! Are you not that famous witcher, Geralt of Rivia? I believe I have work for you. Saw your notice. Mentioned a monument. The matter is a delicate one, but mind you, I pay well. Unless I can say no more at this stage. Interested? The statue. Just tell me, what's the problem? A picture's worth a thousand words. More, I dare say. Come with me. I'll show you. Here it is! Our pride and joy, Reginald Daubry. A giant among lovers. A poking puncturing swordsman, and atop all that, an unrifled titler of harps and other organs. Mm -hmm. So what's wrong with it? How should I put this? It's lost its jewels. Somebody stole the testicles off a statue. No ordinary statue, mind you. The sole monument made using a cast of the great Reginald's own genitals. Certified and authenticated. Sprung directly from his loins, they grant all who stroke them unparalleled virility. All who buy a ticket, that is. Thus, you must retrieve those stones. Got my attention. Now tell me about this Reginald, all you know. There's so much to tell. Legend has it he and the architect Faramont planned and laid out Beauclair. Hmm. Impressed already. In particular, Reginald took great pains to devise escape routes for lovers caught with their pants down. Literally and metaphorically. He later made frequent use of them himself. Not out of fear, mind you, but to avoid having to kill his rifles in duels. Got any suspects? Considering the vast potency of Reginald's prized pouch, everyone's a suspect. Who would not want it for himself? Any idea when the theft took place? It must have been mere hours ago. I guided the last group through the exposition quite recently. Stones were very much in place. Need to look around. Might find a clue or two. Do what you must, as long as you return grasping Reginald's stones. Without them, Beauclair's entire tourist sector faces trying times. Trying times. Don't worry, Reginald, don't worry. You shall be whole again soon. Saw marks are straight and clean. Precision castration, I call this. It will all work out. It must. Dried blood stain. Don't worry, Reginald. Don't worry. You should. It will all work out. It must. Piece of coat fabric caught on the nail. Heavy on cologne. Smell it'll lead me to the thief. Diamond saw blade. Perpetrator's tool. Don't worry, Reginald. Don't worry. You... It will all work out. One more! And 
Come knights, come mates, come poets, come adventure lovers. The North must be a terribly barbaric land. We both speak exquisite wine, and that's rather enough to have a very good time. Hey! Excuse me. Oh! Interrupt, I guess. This, this is not what it seems. <laughs> Word of honor. I, I, I tripped, rolled, tumbled, and landed where she already lay. Psst! Hughes! That's not him! I, I swear, this is all an unfortunate coincidence. A series thereof. What? <sighs> that's not my husband. You mean... Not your husband? Who are you? And why are you in my home? Out! Now! Or I'll summon the guards! Watch your tone, Gramps. Just here to talk. I... Uh, I believe we have nothing to talk about. Oh, we do. We do. Just to kick things off, you're in great form for a man your age. <clears throat> I eat well, start the day with a glass of wine. That preserves a body wonderfully. Interesting. Might try it. Say, ever heard of Reginald Dobry, his statue? <laughs> Everyone in the city's heard of it. Reginald's a paragon, a national hero. Cut the bullshit, Hughes. You stole Reginald's testicles. Know that already. I... Uh, I can explain everything. Uh, this... Rosalinda! I know you're in there! You had that fancy pants of yours! Oh no, not him too. This really is not my day. Got you, you rogue! Prepare for a shellacking skeleton! What the love's this?! Rosalinta! One I could forgive you, but two at one time! Wait, got nothing to do with this. <laughs> Take me for a fool! I'll teach you to fish in another man's pond! You heard me. Calm down or you'll wind up picking your teeth up off the floor. Tough, are you? Come here! Come on, you scamp! Horribly for me had you not intervened. I thank you for saving my skin. Mm hmm. So, time to talk. <sighs> Rosalinda, my dove, please allow us a moment. All right. I admit I stole the stones. And you will never believe it. But. They work. Today, Rosalinda and I, well, three times and counting. Three times? Impressive. Isn't it? At my age. That's more than the entire last decade. All the same, you stole those stones and you gotta return them. 
Listen, perhaps we might strike a deal. Hmm? Let me keep the stones. I'll pay you. Grant me this, I beg you. They... They've made me young again. No chance. Need to take the stones, pure and simple. But... but if you were to leave them with me for, for a day or two, uh, three at the most... Shit out of luck. Sorry. At the day's end, it's good I had a chance to use them at all. Here, take them. Thanks. And good luck. Actually think you'll do just fine without them. What's new, mon ami? As I recall, he slew a few beasts and stashed a pile of gold. Have you recovered Reginald's family jewels? Yep, got them back. Lepiotus luscious lips, it's them! It's really them! I hope this modest reward nonetheless conveys the extent of my gratitude. And look in on us tomorrow for the grand reopening. You shall stroke Reginald at no charge on the house. <laughs>